the Nittany Lions coming in on the heels of a sweep last week against Holy Cross and the first face-off of the season won back by the Bears. We are underway. Back to Hood. Let's go a wrist shot and scores! Get her the puck! And Anna Hurd has tied the game at one! Power play goal for the freshman from Pelham, New York. And Anna Hurd just sent a little one down, fluttering, and ties the game at one. Extra skater rod between the circles. Sick the drive. Puck loses in front and scores! The extra attacker on, and the Bears have tied it at two! It was again Sickich in front, and I think it's going to be Hurd getting credit for the goal. There was a lot of traffic on Boffin, who is so rarely the one to give up two goals. I got goosebumps, folks. You don't see that too often. What heart from the Brown Bears as they pull the goaltender and get an extra attacker goal to tie the game at two. Working in. Toward the side, what a save as getting the pillows closed was Haley Klisko. Klisko came up to the top of the crease, got her legs both down in the butterfly, and was fortunately able to close down the five hole with the dangerous, very dangerous Zanon. In 25 years, I don't think I've been this satisfied and smiling over a tie. Down to the finish and down to the wire, the Brown Bears... And the Penn State Nittany Lions skate 65 minutes to a 2-2 draw. Two goals for Browns. Anna Hurd, a goal for Julie Goff and Natalie Heising of Penn State. As the Brown Bears rally, score an extra attacker goal. And we'll do it all again tomorrow with a Sunday afternoon tilt.